so it's really difficult it's full of rock and uh, have proper breakfast and come miles and miles to go before i sleep we came to kodaikanal town to do some shopping if you are lucky enough you can see us sliding and going down the second day in kodaikanal we are all set to go for a trekking hope you have already watched my previous episode from kodaikanal wherein i tried to cover almost all the major tourist spots in kodaikanal we are already in for breakfast looks like we are the first family to come in dolphin nose it's better you come early if you're planning for a trek here this will be open from 6 am it's a very narrow road as you can see in the video yesterday we had been to watakanal falls so this takes the same route as in the flow of the watakanal falls It's very difficult when there are two cars coming in because it's that narrow. Also, if you come early morning, you need not get this much of traffic. Also, we are also not very late. It's uh, about to be nine. It is eight forty-five now. Let's start with the trekking. and uh, we parked our vehicle before entrance itself because if we come till here it's very difficult to find a proper parking and while going back also it will be really difficult it is not definitely easy but it's easy for me oh my god it's easy for sham it seems for me it's not that easy okay because it's like full of rock and please come in proper trekking shoes otherwise you will be suffering like chinju so it's really difficult it's full of rock and uh, have proper breakfast and come and also carry some water even though you will get some cafe on the way <laughs> oh, <you're going. laughs> actually mom and appus are actually sleeping mom came for breakfast after that she went to sleep But the music and all people are going. Next time, I think we should come with a speaker so that we can dance, sing, cry, and go. See, this is the second time me and Sham are taking this trekking path because it's really worth. Uh, we came during December last time, so it was full of fog even in this route. So it was even more fun. The vision wasn't clear also. but uh, that time we came in the afternoon but it is really difficult if you come in the afternoon better to come in the morning and don't come late evening now we are almost reaching the end Where in again we have to take a turn from there. Come, it's a slope. If you are lucky enough, you can see us sliding and going down. From here you get a mountain view, which is really exemplary, a mind blowing view. You are going to see now. Last time we didn't get the visual from here because it was full of fog. This time at least we can see the beautiful view from here, the mountain view. Last time we had sandwich and all from here. Maybe while coming back, we'll have to definitely have. Yeah, this is the view. Wow! Look at this spectacular view from here. 
So if you do not come here, you are going to miss something. So when you are in Kodai Canal, if you are in a condition to walk down so much of steps, then please do come here because this is a must visit place. Such a pleasant view from here. You can find few village homes, and you can find some small small shops. And there's a small water crossing here. It's a small waterfall, and we have to just cross this natural bridge. Wow, it's nice. Such natural trekking routes are really awesome, right? This is a real experience. So once you reach Mountain View, I've seen most of the people go back, thinking like it's gonna be hectic, take more steps towards the end point. But please don't stop because after that you can find a paradise. Look here, the pine forest. How nice it is, right, Chinja? Chinja doesn't have breath, also to speak. <laughs> Miles and miles to go before I sleep. <laughs> After the pine forest, you will come almost closer to the dolphin nose. Finally, we made it to the place. We took around half an hour. And this is the dolphin nose, which is in the shape of a dolphin's nose. But uh, when we came during December, the view was different completely different it was full of fog and we couldn't even see the tip of the dolphin nose i'll try to attach the shots from that time so we are trying to go towards the tip of the nose there is a queue to take pics Last time also we were waiting like this. We did trekking, we went up to the nose, the dolphin nose point and there was a cameraman who did take some professional pics for us. So we are waiting for that. Till then we can go even more down and see some view from there. So let's see if it is easy to go till there. We'll give it a try. This is the viewpoint from here. Definitely a paradise. There are so many paradise on earth itself. If you are in a position to travel, please do travel. Try to reach how much ever paradise as possible. Have fun in life. Enjoy each and every moment of life. Got these beautiful pics well captured. Wow. Now we are heading back. Now we have to climb up the hallway and that is going to be a challenge. But we have to. Let's push off. Come on. Now 
while we are going back we could see this fog so maybe we cannot see a clear view as what we got for real it's covered with fog now of the same place is full of fog while going back from dolphin nose it is challenging than the trek actually <laughs> After the great trekking we came to this place called Cocker's Walk it has so many things you have lot of views from here you can even see the dolphin nose view and there is a walking place Kurinji garden dam view so many things we can view from here and this place is ideal to visit early morning or towards evening because you can find a nice view from here scenic views we have come here to have a great walk after the tedious trekking right jinja yeah look now itself you can find a good view of the fog there is entry ticket it is around 25 so for kids above the age of 3 years also we will have to take the ticket look at the view now Oh my god the fog Mom is full happy now because she couldn't see this while we were in dolphin nose point now she got to see this amazing view so for people who can't walk up to dolphin nose point you can come here as well as usual appu has gone into some stall some random stall oh that is where you can find the township of kodaikanal the residential area and uh, you can find all those different colored colored houses fully covered in fog last time when we came here no we could see mountains from here now we cannot even see any mountain because it's fully covered with uh, fog found this 1980s shop which has the memories of all the candies the dollar candy mango bite cigarette candy boomer boom boom boomer when we were about to return from here look at the view the entire fog has cleared out now and we can see the full mountain view from here also the dam There is a dam from here which we can see. After the cockers walk, we came to Kodaikanal town to do some shopping. So mom, sister, Sham, Ryan, everyone are like busy shopping. And this is the best place to come for shopping. And also we wanted to meet one of our old friend who is here. बेटी को ऐसे करते हैं फ्रेंड को कैसे करते दिस इज डेफिनेटली द गिफ्ट ऑफ ट्रेवलिंग बिकॉज वी गेट टू मीट सच ट्रेशर फ्रेंड्स एंड वी आर स्टिल इन कॉन्टैक्ट वी मेट एम आई थिंक टू ईयर्स और थ्री ईयर्स बैक टू थ्री ईयर्स बैक बट स्टिल वी आर इन टच सो दैट इज द पावर ऑफ फ्रेंडशिप Yeah, we came for some chocolate shopping, homemade chocolates. We don't know the flavor which we got. Whatever we 
tried and whatever we like we are taking this is the best place for time pass in kodaikanal because you get to ride boat two wheeler i mean cycle horse everything you get here and even you can stroll around through this path evening well spent near the kodai lake we didn't want to take lot of stress today tomorrow we'll have to go back to bangalore we ordered chicken shawai from this hotel hotel anifa we got hot parotta and pepper chicken gravy Yes today we are celebrating 75 years of Indian independence wish you all a very happy Indian independence we celebrated independence day in the hotel where we stayed in Kodaikanal and today we checked out and we are heading back towards Bangalore now we'll not take the Palani road we can take the road which is a direct road from Kodaikanal to Dindigal before leaving we came to Kodaikanal lake we thought we will get a view before leaving towards Bangalore and mom chinju appu everyone are doing few more shopping to get few jackets etc and also some fruit vegetables etc from here it's time for us to leave kodaikanal definitely with a heavy heart a uh, holiday well spent in kodaikanal and palani please to watch all my series of kodaikanal palani trip please to like comment and subscribe to my channel keep supporting me as always it's anju dev vlogs signing off bye